Welcome, Scorpion, to your Abundance in Money and Prosperity reading. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the season of Sagittarian Scorpions. Wow. If this is your first time, please like and share these videos. This video is about how to manifest and uh, how to find out what is happening in the flow of your financial world okay so how is the flow of your money what is happening who is there what is transpiring this is a general reading so um you have to choose what energy you're going to be working with in this season okay so what is happening is that we see two rows we see the top rows the top rows as a symbol it has the rose it has the onyx it has um the pendulum and it has the shoes now these are all um symbols that we use in order to create wealth in our world and this is what is coming up now you scorpion have a very very powerful powerful um season for sagittarian you just ended your own season and you can see the changes that is coming up in this new year for you guys because this is a new year this is when your new year start as a um, you um, change into the Sagittarian season, then that is the first uh, um, new year for you guys. So, Scorpion, what is so good about you guys, especially the Scorpion Cups with Sagittarian? This is going to be good because um, what I'm seeing for the Scorpion Cups with Sagittarian is that you're releasing an energy that you were dealing with, okay? So for you ladies between the age of 18 and 45, there was some sort of a blockages to your financial stability. It could have been another water sign person. Um, it could have been a cancer that was affecting your life by creating some sort of a blockage to your financial flow. And I see that this is going to be ending. So ladies between the ages of 18 and 45, you could have had a friend or a sister or a woman who was creating some sort of a problem um, and that, that was blocking your financial flow. And I see that this is going to be ended. The most beautiful energy is the Empress. And what this is saying is that in um, the second week, you Scorpion is going to be receiving a whole lot of money. So Scorpions, be advised, whatever is happening in Transpire, if you have a business or it could be something that is paying out. You are going to be definitely, definitely receiving a whole lot of money. So this is a wonderful alignment of energy that is transparent. They're going to be finding out also um, that uh, you young ladies be aware and align with the energies because you young ladies, um, I, you know, it's as if... Uh, Someone could have passed away and left you some money and someone is going to be paying this out also. So some of you young ladies could be in mourn, um, mourning over someone that has passed away. But I see this person has left you also a lot of money and it is happening um, um, for a lot of people. Okay, so a big payout is going to be coming in in the second week for you scorpion and this is going to be good third week is a fire week a third week you're standing and protecting your financial stability and i would say yes yes scorpions whatever is happening and transpiring whatever the payout is is as if you are like uh, i have worked hard to receive this money and no one is going to be um taking it or I'm sorry, I'm not going to be uh, supporting everyone um, because you guys know that I received this money. So I see Scorpion, you're really standing and protecting your money. And that is going to be good in the fourth week, uh, in the third week. In the fourth week, you're dealing with another water energy, okay? And this water energy, what is happening and transpiring with this water energy is that um, some sort of an information is going to be coming out about a Sagittarian. So, whoever the Sagittarian is and whatever that was transpiring, the Sagittarian 
you um scorpion is going to be finding out something that the sagittarian has done okay you are going to be realizing that the sagittarian has created some sort of a um situation that was happening and transpiring around you and you're going to be realizing that the Sagittarian has not been honest as you thought they were, okay? And I see that that is going to be um, releasing you from a situation. So it's as if a big payout come and the Sagittarian, all of a sudden, they have a lot of stuff that needs to be done. They're looking at you um, to pay um, some sort of a, a situation, where money is supposed to be coming from you because they are aware that you have this money. And I see that a lot of you Sagittarian is going to be thinking, Jesus, I wish I didn't even say I was getting the money. You Scorpion is going to be saying, wow, I wish I didn't even say I, ha I, I received the money. And I see that this is going to be a turn off for some of you Scorpions because it's as if you're realizing how um, you know, it's as if, oh yeah, so, oh yeah, she or he is receiving some money, so I know. And I see that um, you're going to be finding out that some of you should have even gotten more money. And you were not even aware of this. You're going to be definitely, definitely finding out that some of you should have been receiving some more money. So what we're seeing here is that a lot of you um, scorpions is going to be um, uh, surprisingly realizing um, how much money is going to be paid out to you. And it, it is as if you weren't even aware. So it could be an accident. It could be some sort of a situation that was created by other people that um, has affected your life and you are getting this huge payout and you're like, oh my God, really? I didn't even know. Um, so I see that you guys are going to be really surprised at what is happening um, in the Sagittarian period. And especially if you have Sagittarian in your birth chart, you're going to be blown away at what has happened and what has transpired. You're going to be totally blown away you're going to be thinking no i am not i i did this is like not seeing something coming so it's it could be something that has happened in the past you weren't aware um you walk away from a situation and all of a sudden they realize oh my god this person was unfairly treated here the universe is going to be opening up for you so expect a sort of a situation. So it says that um, some of you Scorpion could have been taken advantage of and they are going to be realizing this and returning or do a big payout. So whatever that was transpiring um, between you and a Sagittarian, I see truths is going to be coming out. And I see there was some sort of information that was blocked from you. The information is going to be coming in to you because they're going to be realizing that you had no idea um, that you were supposed to get a whole lot of money and how people try to block you from get this money and who did it. So a whole lot of truths is going to be coming out. There's no question about this. Um, it is a time. It is a it is as if the Sagittarian period, because you're moving in um, 2021, is showing up for you um, how you are going to be exhilarating um, moving forward. Because some of you, this unexpected money that came in, you're going to be using it to really set set you up. It's good. You're really going to be using it to set you up, and this is going to be good. So whatever the um, issue and the situation is uh, that has to do with money, um, be aware and be sure that you will be um, financial stability is going to be um, yours in this Sagittarian period because you can realize this. So I always say to people, get a year reading and it's not too late for you Scorpions to get a year reading, not a birthday reading, but a year reading. 
um, you can still get a birthday reading because basically we would see what is coming up um, in this Sagittarian series. So what is happening is that you or um, some of you, um, a Capricorn could be helping out some of you and protecting you um, or you could be protecting a Capricorn. So I see that some of you young people, a Capricorn could be um, protecting you and helping you to create wealth. Um, but I see some of you, um, you're protecting yourself from some sort of a situation where people are coming at you as if I am the one, you're the one with the money tree. And I see you Scorpions are thinking, well, if even I'm the one with the money tree, that is over. And I think that you are right to do that because whatever that was happening and transpired, it is uh, unbelievable that people are going to be um, expecting that you always have to carry them to their financial problems, their financial issue and that sort of a thing. And it is about uh, um, people trying to help themselves also as you are doing the same for yourself. So be aware of this, what is happening and transpiring. Hold on to your money. Money is definitely going to be coming in in the series. There is no question about it, but you got to hold on to your money. Um, you can find out what was the secrets, what was happening by choosing one of these, because obviously a lot of you secrets are going to be coming out where you're going to be finding out how people have blocked your financial flow. Okay. And this is like outside influences that has blocked your financial flow. And what you're going to be doing, Scorpion, is like elevating this in order to keep your financial flow going. So you have to look at the energies and choosing one of the symbols there because as choose as you choose one of the symbols there, it is going to be, it's as if it open a frequency and that frequency help you to understand what is the next step that you need to take. So you could receive unexpectedly a whole lot of money. You need to protect this money and you need to use it to create wealth and stability for yourself. And don't like give out, give out. So this is a period where a lot of you Scorpion could win the lottery, the lottery big. Okay. You could do scratch off. And there another it. You could do um, whatever numbers you're buying, they're another it because what is happening and transpiring is that you're realizing that uh, the universe is starting to give to you. And if you were having some sort of a hardship, um, leaving, um, leaving, um, you know, your way, seeing your financial way out and was having some sort of financial strain, this is going to be resolved in this Sagittarian um, season. So they're going to be finding out, uh, and some of you, Scorpion, is going to be finding out something about a young cancer. Um, and it's going to be finding out that this young cancer have been creating some sort of issues in your world. Now, this could be a child, but it could be also a young person on the work floor. And they're going to be finding out that this is a cancer that has took like a whole lot of money from you scorpion and they're going to be finding out uh, who this person is uh, and the money is going to be returned to you okay so wow scorpion this is good please go and look to see if you have sagittarian in your birth chart if you do have sagittarian in your birth chart what is going to be happening and transpiring is that you are going to be exhilarating and helping yourself to move forward um, in uh, um, a positive direction because you're going to be understanding that with this money coming in, money bring friends, uh, but when um, you have no money, there is no friend. So be aware of this. When we have the energy of the nine of wands, especially in um, the third week, uh, um, it is that it is protecting you, okay? So is that you are leaning against... Uh, you're protecting yourself. You're protecting your financial. You're protecting yourself. Okay. Um, and uh, you're blocking people from 
taken advantage of you financially and you stand facing up facing any wars anything to and you're defeat and you're defending your money that is is there okay so this is going to be good so a lot of you are going to be taking some time off in the christmas week in order to think and make a cautious decision before you move forward okay so the night it's, it's all about you standing there thinking how am I going to be um, creating some sort of a new start for me and some sort of a new stabil, um, financial stability for yourself and move you forward and uh, um, through the energy of the moon, okay? So going within and you're going to be receiving inner guidance from your spirit guides as how to, um, you know, prepare um, and create your own um, flow of abundance going forward. So this is good. This is really a good reading for you, Scorpion, who have just started um, 2021 because you are 2020. It depends on who you are. Some people could be starting 2021. Um, some people could be starting 2020 because they actually um, is 2020 for some of you. Depends on where, what time and where, um, where in your Scorpion chart. It can be 2020 for some of you, but it can be, um, 2021 for some of you. So look and find out where Sagittarius is. Um, obviously Jupiter is coming in. This new year is going to be a powerful shift for you in this new year. So you can see you begin this year by receiving a lot of financial advancement that is coming in so in order to see um what is uh, coming up what direction how you should plan with this money that is coming in is uh, choose one of those symbols as you choose one of those symbols um you will exhilarate yourself to the next level i do love you guys i gotta go never stay until next time <laughs>